Good morning, it's uh, Johnny Boy and uh, I'm back again. And uh, I want to show you, uh, I'm having some work done on my own house and some work that I don't clearly understand and that's when you need to bring the professionals in that understand what it's all about. And uh, let's go and have a, have a chat. Morning Paul. Morning John, how are you today? Good, good. I'm going to turn around, the camera's going to be on you now. If you turn around and just have a face camera. And what I'd like you to do, and I, I'm allowed to say this because for, Paul and I have been friends for over 30 odd years now. That's and right. Paul, you're off out with this little room we have here. All it's right. going to be a bit of a, an office space. That's right. Okay, and what I'd like you to do, if, if, if we just have a quick look around, before we ask Paul some questions, and I'll just show you what we've got here. This is a, a room at the back of uh, my garage, and um, if you look up, we've got the door on over here. It's a nice wide door, looking really good. Got the door. It's a second-hand door, but it's ideal for, for this. And I'm going to go over this side. I'm going to ask Paul just to stand. No, 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 you're okay, Paul. Stand to one side over here. And uh, Paul, insulation. What's all that about? We've got half block, half insulation. Can you tell me the value of insulation? I, that keeps, uh, works in two ways. If you can just keeps, turn around and face the camera, yeah, our keeps, viewers will have that. Keeps the heat in. Yes. Also keeps the heat out. Ah, but you've got something well. to keep the heat out. Can no, you so just show I've us what it is? even better to keep the heat out. Okay, so the rock wall is for insulation in itself? Yeah, that's an insulation in itself. It stops a certain amount of heat coming in, stops a certain amount going out, but they've come up with this. It's been out quite a few years now, but this is an absolutely fantastic idea. Works the same way as a uh, vacuum flask, believe it or not. Yeah, if you just bring it up and show up. There you are, look. Exactly the same way as a vacuum flask. Right, let's just recap there. Now, keeps the heat in. This keeps it in and it also keeps summertime. Yes. Get high temperatures. Yes. Going to heat up the fabric of the building. Right, yeah. okay, yeah, yeah. When something gets heated, what does it do when something gets heated up? It gets very hot and uncomfortable, That's doesn't it? it? And it generates heat on the other side of it, doesn't it? That's very clever. So, so in the it's, summertime, it's going to keep the heat right. out. Summertime, that's going to keep the heat out. Shall we look over here now? Winter time, when there's any heat generated. So that's, in that's the like air. a liner. Yes, and it's, it's basically an insulation. Right, okay. And how does that get fixed? This, we just staple this over the battens. Once the wiring's in, as yeah. you see, we leave a void for the wiring because we don't want the, the wiring actually encased in the in inside any insulation. Right, okay. There so we are. basically, I'm just going to go And we're not going to see that on the inside, are we? No, you won't see that because you're going to be cladding over the top Thank of it. Thank you. For the benefit of viewers, we're going to be That's putting it. a cladding finish over the top of this. And by uh, fixing through this, it's not going to compromise it in any way, is no, it? No, no. And the other thing with the Rockwell insulation is you get a certain amount of uh, sand insulation. So you're not going to get noise from outside coming in and you're going to get noise from inside. Right. And I understand that uh, you're working down here in Wales and up in Colchester and towards the Midlands. So if somebody wanted to get hold of you and um, wanted some work or wanted a quote being done, have you got a phone number? Yeah, I'll get the, I'll get the phone number sorted out. Or haven't at present because I'm in... Uh... Yeah, just to recap here, Paul's just uh, come back from Australia. He's been in Australia for five years. Had a little go out there and... Uh, been successful but uh, for, because of family commitments he's back in the UK and uh, he's going to continue where he left off so Paul just um, quickly what sort of things can you do? Uh, all manners of building work extensions yeah. loft conversions garage conversions and you've got a degree in, in uh, structural engineering I have. Yeah. it's not structural engineering it's building studies so basically building study. I'm a qualified building surveyor as well so I can come round if you need any surveying done, you know, so you, haven't, you haven't got to get that additional person in. I can come in and say, right, this is what needs done, this is what needs done. And I understand you do drawings as well? Oh, I can do drawings as well, yeah. Well, okay, well, there you are then. So, really, when you're going to carry out this work because you're, you're hands-on, yeah. but you understand the real science behind it, it's oh, not right. just running in on no, a line or putting no, a no, few no, timbers up. You no, understand no. how it all works. No, you've got to understand the structural side of it as well, and you've got to understand the... Uh, Building regulations as well, that's all important. Well, there you are. I clearly don't understand how all this, all these things work, so that's why I've got Paul in to give me a hand here. I'm, I'm sort of hands-on here helping him, but he knows what he's doing. Look, in the meantime, if you need some advice, you want to get out of Paul, give me a ring, or you can go for the website, which is www.greentoplandscapes.co.uk. Give us a call. I'll see you soon.